message texts. People that got destroyed over texts. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words can't hurt me. Oh no, no honey. No, not in this case. Let's get started. Dude, you're so fat. You wanna know why I'm fat? Why? Cause every time I f your girlfriend, she gives me a biscuit. What was that? Oops, gotta go, biscuit break. If anyone ever calls you fat, this is like the best comeback. And your girl should be fattening me up. I'll give her that D. She give me that biscuit. Do you wanna sit on my face? Why is your nose bigger than your d- <laughs> What's up with guys that say, do you wanna sit on my face? I'll get rid of all the chairs in the world and all that. It's like, what if she accidentally fart? What if that booty stink? What if she just went to the bathroom? What if her booty's so fat you get suffocated? Has that ever happened? Like, has a dude actually been suffocated before? I could totally see that happening. This is not a safe activity. Imagine going to jail for that. <laughs> the headlines like, woman suffocates man with booty. Hey, do you want the washing machine experience? No, I do not want your dirty load. You ruined a perfectly good line! On to the backups! Do you like whales? I don't want to hump back at your place either. <gasps> you win, you have fully beaten my arrogance and deflated my ego. <laughs> at least he's honest! And she's probably so used to these pickup lines she heard them all. She gotta Google them before she replies. I know what's coming, I see it, I smell it from a thousand miles away. It's not gonna work on me. I like how he just accepted defeat, like, okay, that's it, I'ma just move on to someone else. You ruined my whole night. I thought happiness started with an H. Why does mine start with a U? Maybe it's like some subset of dyslexia. <laughs> she calling you dumb. In what universe does happiness start with a U? Youpiness? Is a youpiness. You are the source of my youpiness. <laughs> I just made up a new word. Did you know polar bears weigh about 900 pounds? Do they really? Yeah, so they actually only weigh enough to break the ice if it's 4.8 inches thick. Like you're doing right now. Whoa, are you trying to call me fat? Girl, I ain't even close to 900 pounds. I'm trying to educate you. And here you are, judging me. Are those space pants? Cause you're out of this world. Nope, these are baseball shorts cause I'm out of your league. Oh, damn, I got you on my phone as crush. And I'm finally gonna make a move. You really gonna do this to me. I mean, to be fair, it wasn't even a good pickup line. <laughs> you and Cathay's? Quite close to it, why? Just wondered if you wanted to come over. It's 3 a.m. What's your point? Why do you want me to come over at 3 a.m.? Well, what do you think? So you can murder me? Like, bitch, what you want? What kind of person goes out at 3 a.m.? Trying to do it in the dark? Hide the evidence? Bury my body? So nobody can find out? No, 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 no. You gotta be careful with these online Ashleys. You don't know what they really want. How tall are you? 6'3", why? Oh, good. Yeah, how heavy are you? What? What are the numerical digits that appear on the scale when you proceed to apply your weight onto it? Why does that matter? Why did my height matter? Double standards, bitch! Girls be like, I don't think guys shorter than six feet. And then when he wanna know, how heavy are you? She's like, why does it matter? Uh, can you believe he asked me how much I weigh? That's like so rude. I would hide every chair in the entire world just so you could sit on my face. <laughs> I'd sit on the ground. <laughs> wow! I mean, his was pretty good, but she got, ooh, that was a good comeback. I mean, the ground's a little more comfy. We got Kyle over here, looking for my Juliet, so come on and get to know me. Hey, so do you want me to fake my death now or should I get your family to hate mine first? Both. Lol, do you always use that line? No, of course not, Romeo. <laughs> How are you? Well, my parents are pressuring me into marriage. Who do they want you to marry? Some guy named Paris, but I think he's a little too old for me. Haha, <laughs> well, come and run away with me and we can get married on our own time. How about Wednesday? Ha! <laughs> how about right now? Too soon, I need like three more hours to see if I love you. 
Haha, <laughs> well, I'm willing to do anything to get you to love me. Well, to begin with, try avoiding killing my cousin. That'd be great. Haha, <laughs> why would I want to kill your cousin? Well, I mean, he hates your family and by extension, your best friend. Also, he has a bit of a killing streak. Lol, you're a fucking creep. I'm just trying to be your Juliet. Uh, my Juliet doesn't act like a psycho baby. You're very pretty, but you're just being weird right now. <laughs> and she's gonna link him spark notes for Romeo and Juliet. Boy, you're gonna be like, I want a Juliet, but you don't know anything about a Juliet. How you gonna be like, I want a Juliet? When you didn't even read the book, do you even know what happens? She might be psycho, but you dumb. Here's the spark notes. Educate yourself. That's like saying, I want to stick a deep fried butter. But you don't know that shit's gonna give you diabetes. Did it hurt? Did what hurt? When you fell from heaven. I dug my way up from hell. Oh. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> when your unoriginal pickup line doesn't work. Hey. On a scale to one to America, how free are you tonight? North Korea. <laughs> That's good. Amanda liked your moment. And then the dude is gonna be like, whoop, whoop. Oh. They're gonna do it and then they're gonna get pizza. You down? She's like, nah. Let's go out for drinks. We'll like fall in love and then get married. And then I'll kill you. And then all the money will be mine. Sound like a plan? What do you say? Damn. I mean, even I think she got a little bit psycho. I mean, if you're gonna do that, you don't tell the dude that you're gonna do it. You just do it. Hey, do you wanna be the captain? The captain of what? My That's a strange name for a boat. <laughs> yeah. She's definitely talking about a boat. Do you know the difference between me and my couch? My couch pulls out. You want to know the difference between me and your couch? I have standards for who lays on top of me. Ooh! Sick burn! That was good. Shout out to my girls that know how to do these comebacks. It's too good. You're not gonna pick up a girl by saying, my couch pulls out, and I don't. They're just gonna be like, ugh, no, I don't with this dude. I want your dong. Dog! Dog! Then we should bang. H hang, hang. Ha ha ha! That's good. Okay, come get my dog and we can hang. Know what I'm saying? I want a picture for my birthday. Happy birthday! Of you naked. And he sends her a naked pic. Below the belt! He literally sends a picture below his damn belt! When you really don't want to send nudes. Damn, what are you so thirsty for? He obviously respects himself. And you should respect him too. What are you doing? Laying in my bed. Naked? Yes. Show me. It's dark. I don't care. <laughs> she just sends him a black screen. I mean, this is what you wanted, isn't it? Under all that darkness, I'm naked. I ain't trying to get up, turn the lights on for you so I can take a pic. You know how warm I am in here? Man, I hate leaving my bed when I'm already like in there, comfy, the bed is all warmed up. I ain't trying to get out. I wonder if you like turn up the brightness for this pic and there's like, I don't know, like, like a ghost face or something. You're really pretty, wow. Thank you, you're really cute too. What's your favorite sex position? Uh, it's called the moon. You get 239,000 miles away from me. Whoa, I've never tried that one before. Sounds fun, baby. I'm down to try everything at least once. Did you fall from heaven? Because have sex with me. Sorry, I didn't suffer a head injury during the fall. Oh! She just straight ended him. Some of these girls comebacks, man. These are too good. Is the rest of you as pretty as your eyes? That's for you to decide. Yeah, I don't think it is. Well, okay, bye. Bye. <laughs> it ain't just the girls with the good comebacks. <laughs> I mean, it's like, this girl's like really into me. I could like get with her or do it for the memes. Bro, I have two bad news for you. Combine them. Your girlfriend is cheating on both of us. Ah! Oh! 
Oh no, that's bad news. The real question is which one is the side hoe? Babe, I miss you. And then she sends a pic. Aw, I knew you missed me too. Nope, just showing you what you're missing out on. Joey's coming over tonight. Ah! <laughs> Damn! Woo! Girl, you got all his hopes and dreams up and just destroyed them. You gotta throw in, Joey's coming over tonight. Whatever you did to this girl, I don't want to know, but damn, she got you good. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below which one was the most savage. And make sure you hit that like button in the face. And subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.